and we're live hey guys welcome to this video so here we have a push workout so I started off with the barbell incline bench press so I would have started with the um, with the bar and uh, worked my way up and warmed up but uh, here today uh, I was working on singles so you see me here with um, 195 bit of a grinder there but um yeah today was just singles like I said and uh, I kind of vary my training. It really depends what I'm feeling that day. If I'm working on triples, uh, fives, if I feel like doing um, higher reps, lower reps, or whatever. So I did a bunch of singles here um, just to work on the form, work on some strength. Uh, if you notice, they are a bit of a struggle, quite a bit of a struggle, but they're not absolute grinders. So then after the singles, I moved on to uh, getting some more reps. So here you see me drop down the weight. So this, this adds a little bit more extra volume, um, adds a little bit more time under tension and just kind of works on the movement, works on the, the actual um, pattern of the, the bench press uh, to get that movement pattern ingrained. So here we go. <laughs> So this this right here was uh was my last set, um, so I was doing a drop set here. So I did the first set and then I went immediately um, to strip the weight. Point of this was just to add a little bit more volume, just uh, burn out the pecs a little bit. But if you notice, even on the last rep, again, same with the singles, it's a struggle, but it's not an absolute full on like uh, like RP of ten, right? <laughs> Okay, so now we have uh, laterals. So you can do this on the machine like I was doing here, or you can do it with uh, dumbbells, you can do it with uh, cables, whatever you choose. Uh, today I just felt like doing uh, the machine. So here I am doing, uh, not not too heavy on these. Uh, the real focus is to honestly, uh, to, to isolate the delt. Uh, so you don't have to worry about going too heavy. Here's a machine press here. So I'm just focusing on supplementing what I did on the incline barbell bench just once again to get some more volume in. And here we are finishing the pecs off with a uh, pec fly. So there, there's lots of different ways to do the pec fly, but I think I was doing it pretty much to the middle of my chest, maybe slightly a bit higher to work a little bit more upper pec. As you can see, this whole workout was pretty much whenever I was uh, bench pressing it was mostly for upper pec that's something that i personally want to improve so that's why i choose to hit those angles so it's important for you guys to remember that uh, you got to train based on your goals based on your needs so that's why you see me doing a lot of incline presses <laughs> and finishing it off with triceps so I think I did, I must have done like a good six sets here. So you can pyramid up in weight. Again, don't don't throw the weight around too much. Really focus on using your triceps. You can cheat a little bit towards the end, uh, but really isolate it, really let the triceps do the work and just enjoy it, have fun with it. And that's it guys. That's a quick little push workout for you, enjoy. <laughs> 